Good evening. My life today for March 5th. The reading is entitled Three Hebrew Worthies. The scripture reading is taken from Daniel 3 verses 17 and 18. If it be so, our God whom we serve is able to deliver us from the burning fiery furnace and he will deliver us out of thine hand, O king. But if not, be it known unto thee, O king, that we will not serve thy gods, nor worship the golden image which thou hast set up. A severe test came to these youth when Nebuchadnezzar issued a proclamation calling upon all the officers of the kingdom to assemble at the dedication of the great image and at the sound of the musical instruments to bow down and worship it. Should any fail of doing this, they were immediately to be cast into the midst of a burning fiery furnace. The worship of this image had been brought about by the wise men of Babylon in order to make the Hebrew youth join in their idolatrous worship. They were beautiful singers, and the Chaldeans wanted them to forget their god and accept the worship of the Babylonian idols. The appointed day came, and at the sound of the music, the vast company that had assembled at the king's command fell down and worshipped the golden image. But these faithful young men would not bow down. The king commanded the furnace to be heated seven times hotter than it was wont to be heated, and when this was done, the three Hebrews were cast in. So furious were the flames that the men who cast the Hebrews in were burned to death. Suddenly, the countenance of the king paled with terror. His voice trembled with excitement. The monarch exclaimed, Lo, I see four men loosed, walking in the midst of the fire, and they have no hurt, and the form of the fourth is like the Son of God. From age to age, the heroes of faith have been marked by their fidelity to God and they have been brought conspicuously before the world that their light might shine to those in darkness. Daniel and his three companions were illustrious examples of Christian heroism. From their experience in the court of Babylon, we may learn what God will do for those who serve him with full purpose of heart. Thank you for listening. God bless you.